everybody. I am back in Pittsburgh. Hello. Home from the wonderful world of Disneyland where dreams are made to come true. How do you like my new hands? You like them? We are going to do something fun tonight with, Mich with Michelle and I'm going to wear these hands during or before videos and whenever you see that I have these hands we're actually going to provide you with pop-ups of hidden Mickey's so during this tutorial I'm going to share with you how to do corn row twists for summer on all lengths of hair and during the video we are gonna have a Mickey hidden Mickey pop-up so watch for it when you see it put in the comment that you saw it where you saw it and make sure that you share the video so when you share the video put in comment when you see the hidden Mickey now the hidden Mickey will pop up maybe once maybe twice so every time you see it you comment and every single time that you comment you will be entered in a drawing for my absolute favorite thermal seaweed mask for your face very very nice for your skin so I'm gonna do a drawing for that but don't you love my hidden my little Mickey gloves I love these who loves Disney World if you're on guys make sure you shoot me a thumbs up so that I know that you're on the other end and I'm gonna get to get started with this tutorial as soon as I get these off and we're gonna be using a couple of different things we're going to use Meta Grip Premium Bobby Pins and if you all did not see my video on the importance of choosing the correct bobby pin for the hairstyles of your choice this is very important and you can go to my YouTube videos under cottage clippings and just type in um, bobby pins and you can watch a whole video on how to shop for them and how to put them in so if you're on the other end shoot me a thumbs up or a heart so that I know that you're there we're also going to be using Kenra's platinum working wax I don't know if you can see that uh, we're going to use this to keep the flyaways down and I'm going to share with you how to dispense this and use it because a lot of people buy these working waxes and they really don't know how to use them so I'm going to share with you that hold on a second now remember you guys are looking for hidden Mickey's so when you see a hidden Mickey just comment okay what's the pop up so whenever you see a hidden Mickey you comment that you saw it if you guys know what hidden Mickey's if you see little hidden Mickey Mouse comment that you saw it and then you'll be entered in the drawing okay so here's what we're gonna do yay way to go good job good job Christine okay here's what we're gonna do when you use this working wax guys here's how you use working wax congratulations you guys you guys are good Mallory good job put it in your hand like this and you have to rub it and get it to emulsify a lot of people get the working wax and then they just put a glob of it on their head that is not how you work with working waxes so get them to emulsify in your hand and you're going to feel like the product has disappeared it hasn't it's there then you're going to disperse this off your hair so now you can do this wet or dry we're doing it dry tonight I think wet is best all right so we're gonna do these cornrow twists and to start off I'm just gonna do traditional ones I'm gonna take them across my head I'm gonna do it really slow I'm gonna, so that you guys can catch on uh, I really don't do any fancy parts or anything if you want to section this off if it's easier for you to do you can um, <coughs> But what I like to do is the first twist I like to put um, either right down the center if you want these to go back so that I don't have a part 
down the middle. So I usually put my first twist right down the center or if I want everything to go to the side, I'll put my twists at an angle. But we're just going to do them straight back tonight. Hello, Kibby. And I'm so glad you're on. Hello, hi. Um, because you are my winner from last week. Uh, we uh, did the um, game on our phone. And Kibby, you won my absolute favorite favorite detoxifying bath soak so I'm constantly giving away prizes guys when you see the hidden Mickey pop up make sure you comment because you're gonna win a prize you guys will win the thermal seaweed okay all right here we go okay so we're gonna take the very very front part and you're just gonna turn it and you're gonna keep turning, and as you turn, hold on one second. Okay, as you turn, you're just gonna keep picking up hair on the way. And you just keep twisting, guys. Just keep twisting, just keep twisting. Oh my goodness, I have Disney on the brain. I'm thinking of Dory. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming. Okay, so once you're done twisting, To secure it, this is where the trick is, guys. You know what, again, while we are on vacation, I saw people with these beautiful braids and they took bobby pins and just went like that and smacked a bobby pin. A, the bobby pin wasn't even the right color for the hair and B, it was, you can see it. When you can see it, it ruins your project. So you wanna hide these bobby pins, kinda like the hidden Mickeys, hide your bobby pins. So what we're gonna do is, I'm actually gonna turn the bobby pin, let me see if you can see it. It's gonna be upside down. So the shorter end is gonna be on the bottom. And we're going to slide it in upside down towards the front of the hair, just like that. Okay, then that's it. Now we're gonna start our second twist and we're gonna just keep twisting. And as you're twisting, you're just pulling hair with it. Guys, this is so easy. If you're struggling with doing French braids, just do the twists. If you don't wanna do them on yourself, you can do them on your little kids. But honestly, like any length hair, even if your hair is short, as long as if you have a little bit of hair on top to work with, you guys, you can do this. Again, the bobby pin is upside down and we're gonna secure it in the back and slide it forward. See, and you can't see any of those pins. A, because the bobby pin matches the color of my hair, and B, because it's inside the twist. Again, these are Mega Grip bobby pins. You can buy them at Sally's. They're completely awesome. So if you guys are just joining, um, welcome. It's exciting time because, well, Disney World. But anyway, if you see a hidden Mickey pop up during the video, make sure that you comment. We are keeping track how many times the hidden Mickey pops up because you will be entered in the drawing for fabulous gifts from Cottage Clippings. Okay, so guys, all I'm doing is twisting. This is not hard, I promise. The bobby pin is upside down and we're gonna put it in the back. Just like that. You guys like that Mickey glove? <laughs> All right, okay, so we're gonna to go to the other side and I'm twisting in the same direction. And I'm just going like this. If you guys are tuning in, so this is August the 9th. If this video makes it to your world like two days from now, the drawings are on Wednesday. So, you know, even when this video ends and it's no longer live and you guys have shared this with your friends, they are still entered in drawings. Just so you all know, everybody gets entered. So, okay. Just keep twisting and you're pulling up hair as you're going along. Just like this. You guys got to go on vacation this summer? Where have y'all went? I'm kind of curious. Hey, 
Great job, Christine. Saw the hidden Mickey. We got people posting hidden Mickeys. So did you guys happen, if you're on my Facebook page, happen to see the good news? I have a little doggy that's going to be a mommy. We think. We're almost positive. Because today she's not really eating. I think she already has morning sickness. Mm, I'm so excited. We might have puppies. Little golden doodle puppies. So if you guys are interested in golden doodles, they will be ready to go home if all goes good. December 20th, they will be Christmas puppies. They have a lot of energy, people. If you're interested in golden doodles, just make sure you have time to let them run because they are the sweetest babies, but they need exercise. Okay, so thank you. Thanks, Christine. All right, again, we're pinning these backwards. What do you guys think? That's pretty easy. That's not too hard. Um, I think that the struggle that people have is with a bobby pin. And again, you need a really good bobby pin. This bobby pin, bobby pin has one, two, three, four, five humps in it. And that's really a big deal because it aids in securing it really, really well. A lot of the cheaper bobby pins only have three. Uh, and they're called Mega Grip. So they're actually covered with a grip substance so that they stay in your hair. So anyway, this is really, really simple. It's great for summer. The wind can blow anywhere. You can go to the beach and your hair, you have sustainability in your hair. So um, don't forget how to emulsify your pomades, especially you guys. If this video makes your way and you just, I know you're probably not going to do this to your hair, but maybe you will. <laughs> so make sure that you mossify your pomades before you put them in your hair for those really cool short hairstyles. So comment the Hidden Mickey guys, share the video. I can't wait to release the winner next Wednesday night. And so next Wednesday night, I'm going to be sharing with you what I eat. Um, last week I shared a little bit about an autoimmune disorder that I was diagnosed with and I maintain it medicine free no medicine whatsoever so next week I'm going to share with you where I shop I shop at all the local stores I don't buy any fancy shakes I'm not part of any program I did a lot of research and um, I had a lot of experience with a dietitian who's fabulous so I'm going to share with you all of the things that I eat next week so stay tuned and love y'all have a great summer bye